interview at the animal shelter at 2 o'clock, right? 12 o'clock? But it's 12.30 now! Ah! But I called for a cab half an hour ago! I'm supposed to be at the Cosmetics <coughs> Expo in 15 minutes! What do you mean I can't have a backstage pass? I am getting a pass if I have to come right down there myself! <coughs> hey, guys! My fashion show was canceled. Anyone want to go to the mall with... Not now! Gotta go! Yasmin, do you wanna... No, can't. Hey, Bunny Boo, how about I tag along with you? Stay here and answer the phones. Well, yes, ma'am. After all, I guess I've got nowhere important to rush off to. I'll just answer the phones. Hmm. And do stuff. Here. By myself. Well, at least I'm not totally by myself. Oh. Hi there, Micah, little sweetie. Come hang out with your favorite person. <gasps> Guess today I'm no one's favorite person but my own. Listen, you! I asked for a shipment of hot new togs from Oscar de la Rini. Not new hot dogs from Oscar de la Weenie. No, I did not place the order myself. I left it up to my hollow-headed assistants. Hang on. What? Von Von Wurstenberg? The mother of pink? <laughs> Miss Von Wurstenberg, your fashions have been such an inspiration. I trust our interview is canceled. But they what? I asked them to send you a fruit basket, not fruit bats. Well, surely the drapes can be dry cleaned. <laughs> You have puncture wounds. Oh. Hello? Hello? Ah! Like, hello? Where have you two been? We were at the laundromat. Yeah, washing your unmentionables. What unmentionables? We're, like, not allowed to mention. Ah! You fools! My brand new Louis Couture handbag from France! You shrank it! Silly! We wouldn't wash your big old handbag. We bought this for you. You did? Yeah, because we, like, accidentally ran over your big handbag and dragged it down the street. Then it got stolen by some smelly guy. But I guess it wasn't his style, because he just, like, took out all your credit cards and threw them in the sewer. Which just goes to show, big handbags are out, small ones are in. That does it! You don't, like, want it? I don't want you, either of you, ever to set foot in my office again. But, duh, how will we come to work? You won't, because you're fired! And this time, I mean it. Royal, show them the door. <laughs> Great. Thanks to those nincompinks, I actually have to pay someone to answer my phone. Hello, Stylesville Employment Agency. Send a temp to Your Thing magazine. I don't care if no one wants to work here. Find someone. And I'm paying money, so she better be good. I don't know about you guys, but I am wiped out. I hear you, pretty princess. All I want is a quick smoothie before I go home and crash. I just sat through the dullest interview. The animal shelter lady kept yawning and saying how she was dog-tired and wanted to curl up for a cat nap. Yeah? Well, I finally got backstage after the concert, but I was the only one backstage. Everyone else went for pizza. Ugh, the air 
conditioning was broken at the makeup convention. My makeup smeared so much, I looked like a melting clown. Thanks. Smoothies. I would not wish today on anyone. Except, Except the, the Tweebles. <laughs> oh, hey, the guys. Hanging out. Without me? I'm just really glad that Jay didn't come with me. Huh? I know. It would have been horrible if she had tagged along. She so did not deserve to be at that convention with me. What? <laughs> to Jade, may she stay as far away from us as possible. Things you know are what I mean? back in that. that. Well, fine then. If they want me to stay away, then I will. <laughs> it's like that brat girl, Jade. And she's like crying. <gasps> Let's make fun of her. What's the matter, crybaby? Yeah, did you just make Berdine mad and get fired from her magazine? You got fired? What a tragedy. <laughs> you once got fired by Berdeen. You got me fired by Berdeen. Yeah, okay. But once you were fired, how did you, like, ever recover? I started my own magazine. With my ex-friends. Ex-friends? You mean the brats dumped you? No, they... Ugh, mind your own business. But we have, like, no business to mind! Without Berdine, we're nothing. Nothing times two, which is worse! Come on, we won't make fun of you, we promise. And hey, I'm, like, sorry we got you fired a long time ago. It was, like, really not good of us. Okay, time for a reality check. My friends are totally mean to me. And now, my two worst enemies are actually being nice? Hey, after today, I guess anything is possible. Okay, you wanna know what my friends did? They dissed me, ignored me, treated me like, well, you guys do. Ew! So let's just say I'm not feeling too friendly toward them right now. Well, hey then, why not hang out with us? We've got so much in common, like needing friends, for instance. We'll be such way good friends, your old friends will be, like, jealous. Jealous? Furious, more like it. Dumping them for Kirsty and Casey would be the ultimate diss. Oh, let's do it! Okay, I'll hang with you, but on one condition. No being mean. It's not my style. Deal! BFF secret handshake! <laughs> That's even more secretive! Same thing in the cafeteria like every month. Hi, Jade! Hey, cool cat! What's up? Um, why is Jade sitting with the Tweevils? Um, why are you, like, sitting with us? Because we're BFFs. You mean you weren't just being nice to us yesterday because we got fired? Duh, baloney brain. How can you be so dense? I swear, sometimes it's like you... Uh, uh, uh. Remember, no being mean. Oh, yeah. Never mind. <gasps> That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me! Ugh, stop being so sappy. You're gonna, like, make me cry all over again. What are they saying? I tried reading Casey's lips, but there's too much gloss in the way. <gasps> I think Kirsty's crying. But why is Jade with them? Only one way to find out. The direct approach. Hello, girls. Like, what are you 
No, it's Sasha. Hi, Sasha. Is there something we can do for you, Sasha? Um, well, yeah, I guess. See, this whole thing right here is just whack. And I want, no, I demand to know what's going on. Why I'm eating lunch with my friends, Kirsty and Casey. Your friends? Since when are they your friends? Since, like, yesterday. We have a BFF secret handshake. And you can't see it. Okay, is this one of those hidden camera shows? No, it's real. Real friendship is neato. We can't help it if some people are just too narrow-minded to accept it. Narrow-minded? Now, if you don't mind, I think we'll finish our lunch outside, where people know how to treat each other. Well, Bunny Boo, she's not actually friends with the Tweevils, is she? <sighs> not only is she friends with them, she dissed me! <gasps> but why? Maybe the Tweevils planted a chip in Jade's brain. Maybe they have chips in their brains. Maybe they're all being turned into zombie drones for a worldwide chip-headed conspiracy. This is weird, Angel, but I don't think it's that weird. We have got to get to the bottom of this. Okay, when the direct approach fails, time to use the indirect approach. What in the name of neglect is wrong with this picture? <coughs> it hasn't been dusted in months. Getting rid of those useless interns was the best idea I ever had. Just look at all this unfinished work they left behind. Unpolished shoes, unpolished polish, unanswered hate mail. Now if only that worthless temp agency will send me a replacement. Lady, Big Bone Gal magazine is on the fourth floor. I am Dagmar Schadenfreude. I have been sent by Stylesville Employment Agency. Mutter Von Pink, my new assistant. Enough small talk. This office reeks of inefficiency. And dog. And weenies. I see you have a vast backlog of hate mail. I shall answer it at once. Pinch me, Royale. I'm dreaming. Ow! This is so exciting. Our first trip to the mall as best friends forever. Let's take our pictures in one of those teeny tiny picture booths. Yeah, then let's drink a whole bunch of root beer and have a burp off. <laughs> what? Don't girlfriends do that? Every person is different, Casey. And if you want to have a burp off, that's okay with me. There you go, being nice again. <laughs> it's like almost starting to feel natural. You know what, BFFs? What? what? We're gonna do it all. Come on. Attention, boss woman! The files are color-coded, starting the topaz for time-consuming. Time-consuming? Furthermore, I have organized your calendar five months into the future. Make no plans on Christmas. But I'm already worn out, and I'm hungry. You didn't let me eat lunch. Eat this! Raw vegetables? Cooked food makes one sluggish. But... Enough workplace bonding. It is time for your doggy's bath. Come, doggy. I have assembled a horse and a bucket in the alley for you. Well, I want it efficient. <laughs> and I can't stand it!
It's a step. A step? Just look at us. Like a whole non-pig world has opened up for us. BFF, you have touched our souls. Great. And you know, you guys haven't been half bad either. But listen, it's getting kind of late. I need to go to work. Ugh, with your ex-friends. Oh, yeah. Don't worry about me, though. I can handle myself. See you later. Bye! Ugh, what a great BFF we have, Casey. You said it, Kirsty. She gives and gives. And yet all we do is take. Hello, Bratz Magazine staffers. Look, cool cat. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just here to work. You can work and still be friendly. Oh, I would be. If there were some actual friends in the room. Say what? <sighs> what is wrong with you? Come on, girl. Time to talk. All day long, you've been acting like you're someone else. Palling around with the tweevils. Laughing, talking, shopping. It feels like the whole world's been turned upside down. Oh, really? Is that what it feels like? You mean like maybe you've been totally dissed? You can say that again. Well, good. Now you know what it feels like. Diss, diss, diss. All you do is diss. Every one of you. <sighs> we diss. You're the disser. You dissed me first. Did not. Did so. Jade, I believe you, you no, started you it. We did not deny it. And all of a sudden, you're coming in here and acting like such a liar. Stop it, stop it, stop it. What are you even talking about? Oh, please, like you don't know, hanging out behind my back. I'm just really glad that Jade didn't come with me. To Jade, may she stay as far away from us as possible. Oh no, you didn't diss me at all. Oh, a cool cat, I'm so sorry. You overheard us at the juice bar? You bet I did. But we weren't, we didn't mean those things how they sounded. We just came back from a terrible day. We were all saying how glad we were you didn't have to suffer through it with us. Yeah, well, what about the office yesterday morning? I guess we were pretty short with you. Hey, you know what, Cool Cat? I'm really sorry. We all got off to a bad start. The last thing I ever want to do is hurt your feelings. Please, yeah, really. Don't be mad I'm anymore. I'm so sorry. Aw, I've missed you guys so much. Friends again? Totally. Oh, yeah. We of missed course. you too. You uh -huh. got it. But, uh, since you're friends with the Tweevils now, does that mean we've got to hang with them too? Oh, no, don't worry. I've got to say, though, they surprised me. Once you get to know them, they can actually be kind of nice. <laughs> I started hanging out with them because I was mad at you guys. I knew it had to be something like that. I mean, Kirsty and Casey? Those were the last two people I would have expected you to be friends with. Yeah, well, me too. Like, you too? Kirsty? Casey? Talk about a super total diss! And you say you don't do mean. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, Casey, can you believe our BFF isn't really our BFF? She is if BFF stands for Big Fat Phony! Like, duh, that would be BFF. Not BFF, genius. Uh, would not. What so? <laughs> no! All the organization, all the efficiency. I can't stand it anymore. Please, my incompetent interns, come back to me. Do you like promise not to pretend to like us? I couldn't if I tried. Deal! Kirsty, Casey! Well, 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 what have we here? Gosh, I don't know. Maybe a big fat phony? <laughs> <laughs> More like a 
big falling fool. Yap, yap! Looks like you finally got put in your place. Stop flapping your gums, you lazy lunkheads, and change into something decent. We have a temp to fire. Ooh, oh, like goody. Neato. Micah, if I ever hurt your feelings, please just let me know. Because this bearing a grudge stuff is a big old pain in the backside.